Welcome to Reanimator Reviews. My name's Rayan, and I don't... Is this a horror movie? I watched The Garbage Pail Kids because I was not allowed to watch anything like this when I was a child, and I wanted to see what that's all about. Wow. So... This movie is based off of the very loved trading cards, the Garbage Pail Kids, with several characters based off of them in this film. It opened up with a Garbage Pail kind of spaceship flying around Earth, and then we go straight to, I think it's Captain Manzini's store, where there is a Garbage Pail, gets knocked over, and the Garbage Pail Kids come out, and he comes out, kind of polices them, tells them to get back in the pail. There's a child that works there or lives there or something named Dodger who is in love with this weird girl clothing designer named Tangerine who is a complete bitch constantly to him. She is dating the leader of this gang that also beat the crap out of Dodger. <sighs> Essentially, the Garbage Pail Kids get released and are trying to help Dodger win over Tangerine for some reason, even though she's just horrible, while trying to not get sent to the home for the ugly, which is where they think all of their other friends are, which I'm just, I'm a little lost with this movie. I don't think it's supposed to be incredibly complex as it is geared towards children, but like what the hell was the spaceship floating around? Is that where the rest of them are and they think they're in this home, but they're really not in the home, but they're aliens? I don't know. I never got to play with the cards. I don't know what's happening. I'm going to leave it off there. What did I like about this movie? It's really bizarre. It's very strange. Maybe I would appreciate it more had I seen it as a child and then I'd have that nostalgia for it. The the character design is so creepy and their mouths move but like not how they should move with their words. The one that's a crocodile or alligator, I think it's an alligator just just flopping around when it's supposed to be talking, just real creepy. I liked his tail, that was cute. Uh, there's not a lot to like about this movie. There's a horrible musical number in it where they're trying to make clothes so Dodger can play them off like he designed them to impress Tangerine so she can be more of a bitch to him. This movie's just like, I don't know. I know that it's trying to preach that outside stuff does not matter, which it doesn't. And, you know, the beauty in people is inside and Tangerine's a bitch and don't beat up little kids, I suppose. There's a lot of... It's weird. It's real weird. I still feel bad that there's all these people trapped in the the home for the ugly. There's like a blind guy in there. Like, you need to fuck off with that. That's rude. That's very rude. What was this movie? I just... I, uh, I had to sit there for a little bit after it was over. Just like, what, what did I watch? I don't get it. I'm a big fan of the Muppets, and this was not the Muppets. This was just some other weird puppets going on, and I just, I don't, I don't get it. And then at the end, they made them all go in the garbage pail, but then they didn't go in the garbage pail. They just kind of disappeared into the night. Why did I buy this movie? I don't know, but I needed it. And I'm glad it's in my collection now, but also, what the fuck? What is this? I don't know. I don't even know how to rate this movie. I guess I would give it, like, a 2 out of 5 just for being purely bizarre and having atrocious 80s fashion. I don't- is that- I don't know. I'm at a loss, guys. Have you seen this movie? What are your thoughts? Did you collect the cards when you were a kid? Did you see it and have that nostalgia thing thinking back on it? Because I always feel like that with the never-ending story. Like, that's still one of my favorite movies. 
and looking at it now, you're kind of like, oh, the effects aren't that great, and Falcor doesn't look as cool as you remember, but, like, still pretty cool. Like, who doesn't love Falcor? Leave me a comment down below. I'd love to know your thoughts. Um, <sighs> subscribe if you haven't already. I'd love to have you. A lot of my reviews aren't this bad, but this movie just, like, what is this movie? Hit the bell for all notifications of my further uploads and live streams. You can also find me on Facebook at Reanimator Reviews, Twitter and Instagram at Reanimator. My solo and reviews with the groom are available in podcast form on iTunes. Thank you to the Farsighted Network. Also, please check out all of their um, creators for awesome content. My mind is just like garbage. It's garbage. I'll see you later, guys. Thank you.